Hey guys, what's up? So, I'm sorry that I keep doing these like ranty kind of videos. Uh, I plan on doing another hysterectomy update next week after my appointment, but uh, until then, I just am going to speak my mind. I've been doing a lot of reading and like soul searching. I haven't had this much downtime in a really, really long time. So it's just been a really good time to take a break, take a step back, and just kind of spiritually explore. I've been doing a lot of reading. It really brought to light how much I've really, really struggled in my life to be vulnerable. I absolutely hate being vulnerable. How much I struggle with feeling enough, or how much I struggle with feeling worthy or deserving. And uh, so since reading this book, I have been kind of trying to tell myself every, every time that I'm mean to myself or I get down on myself, I just try to think of the term like I am enough and I kept telling myself dude like you're enough stop stop being so hard on yourself it just wasn't really sinking in and I couldn't really I just couldn't grasp the concept that I was enough like it still didn't feel like I was like yeah I'm enough but I could be doing this this and this what if I'm just not pushing myself what if I'm not working hard enough what if I'm missing opportunities because I keep telling myself like you're enough you don't have to do these things and so it just created this mass anxiety inside of me. And I've been dealing with a lot of anxiety since I've had time off work. And it's just because I feel like I'm wasting my time resting. Yeah, I'm just not used to the rest period. But I'm finally grasping how important rest is. And that I deserve, the, I deserve to rest, first of all. Um, but let me just tell you what helped me grasp this concept. So... I was reading in Elizabeth Gilbert's book and there was a certain story that she was telling about how she walked up to this author that she really admired and she got her attention and she said, you are extraordinary and I love you. It caught me by surprise but my mind was like, damn, that would be so awesome for someone to come up to me and be like, just grab you and just be like, you are extraordinary and I love you. In that moment, it just clicked. I was just like, holy shit, I'm still searching for that outside acceptance. I'm still wishing that someone else would get my attention and tell me that. I wish that someone would tell me that I was extraordinary and that they love me. And then that's when I was like, this is where my head is wrong. This is why I can't grasp the concept of feeling worthy and enough because I still want someone else to validate that for me. In all honesty, <laughs> until I can validate that for myself, I'm not going to believe anyone that's going to tell me that in person. So it just made me see that I've been working for a really long time and exhausting myself, always feeling like I had something to prove, always feeling like I had to prove it to myself that I was worthy that I was enough, I had to prove it to, to other people that I am worth something, that I'm worth time, that I'm worth energy, that I'm worth love and friendship and etc. And I just felt like the harder I worked, maybe the closer I'd get to being, to being worth something. And it's just like all this anxiety is being built up in me because I don't feel like I'm worth something. And then in that moment after reading that line and thinking those thoughts, like it just all hit me and I just broke down my god I don't need other people to tell me this like this is something that I need to tell myself I realized that I am enough just waking up in the morning for another day is extraordinary every day that you survive is extraordinary everything that you do every piece of hard work that you put in Every single day of rest that you get is extraordinary. Life is extraordinary. And the fact that we are alive is such a gift. There's so many ways that, so many things and ways that we can get down on life. And the reality is that we're still here able to connect and communicate and laugh and love. And that makes life so much more extraordinary. So on that note, it made me also realize that instead of working my ass off to try to get someone else to tell me that I'm worthy of something or that I'm extraordinary or that they love me, is that I need to look in the mirror every day and tell myself, you're extraordinary and I love you. And 
that is really hard for me to say um but i need to really believe that for myself or else it's i'm not gonna believe anyone else that says it to me i am rambling <laughs> but uh yeah that's all i wanted to say guys i hope that you have an awesome day and just remember that you are enough and that you are extraordinary and that you are loved peace out i will see you next time